How to import PST files in Gmail? Are you tired of finding reliable solutions? We provide you the two methods to import PST file in Gmail. First one manual method, now follow the producer. Go to Google and enter, Google Workspace Migration for Microsoft Outlook. Click on the link shown on your screen. You can choose any link to download the tool as per your need. I am moving forward with E, X, E file recommended for user, after the downloading is complete. Enter your Gmail ID here, check and uncheck the remember me, as per the need, then hit the continue button. Enter your password here, and click on next button. Click on allow button. Select the file. Click on open. And move down to the login panel. As you see there are two options. Which is, migrate all data, and, migrate only new data. I am going to migrate all data, hit next. On next window, there are few options, select if you want to import, and you can select the date filter as with after and before options. The click on migrate button, migration processing. When it done, pops up, and click on OK. Here is your result. Now the rest one is automated method. SysTools Outlook to G Suite migration. Let's check out its main features. Import Outlook emails, contacts, calendars, and documents into G Suite account. Option to bulk migrate Outlook PSP files to Google Workspace account on Windows OS. Import a CSV file having all the source and destination mailboxes mapped in it. Allows selective data migration to Google Workspace with a date filter. Go to Google and enter, SysTools Outlook to G Suite Migrator. Click on the Outlook to G Suite link. Then click on the download button. Now install and run the software. This is an interface of the software. On top left you see the two options, Backup and Restore. Select the Restore, and, Outlook as Source, and G Suite as Destination. Moving down, four options appear on the screen, select and you can filter them according to the date. Then click on next button. Now in, source, panel. Select the folder path, then click on the validate button. Then click on next button. Now in the destination panel. Enter the required details. Click to next. Now you receive the three options. I am moving forward with fetch the user. Data appear here. Click on the Validate button. Validation complete. Click on Start Restore button. Scanning complete status appears in green check. On top there are two buttons available. Rerun Restore. You can use this option if needed. And with Download Report. Simply you will get the migration report. And that's it. Hope you enjoy the video. Log on to the given product page. For more details on purchasing the product. For any query, mail us at support at the rate Thank you for watching.